but before we move on to our routes, I mean, get, post, put, delete, and learn what is it, we need something to test our HTTP responses and requests with some application. And right there with help comes Postman, which is a popular tool for API development and as I said, testing and allowing us to send HTTP request and examine the whole response that we've got. And to get the Postman, first of all, you would have to create your account. It's for free. Don't worry, you don't have to get the full payment version of Postman. Whenever you create your account, you can download your Postman by clicking product and get started for free. Then you should go and download the current version of your operating system. On my case, it's macOS and I can choose which version I would like to have, of course, if not, you've got over here to download for another operating system if you need. And how Postman works and what you can achieve. First of all, you should be sure that you are your account is logged in. And if it's not, there will be a big O button to log in to your account. And how the Postman work? I will just briefly show you with our example of our previous application that we created. As you remember, we've got our Express.js application running. And to test it via Postman, we create a new HTTP. And over here, we will just create HTTP slash slash localhost and 3000. Send. And over here, as you can see, we've got the same result as we've got inside our web browser. But also, as you can see, we've got uh, much more options, not only get as we can achieve using only the web browser link, but also post, put, patch, delete, and another ones. And with that in mind, remember to download, install, and create an account and log into your account with Postman and see you at the next lesson.